Let's talk about Joker 2. Complete utter trash. It was a waste of time. Like, it was like, why did they even make this seat? I don't understand. I don't get it. Like, it just felt like Todd Phillips was forced or, or convinced. Hey, we're going to give you more money. Let's just make a sequel. And he's like, okay, I didn't want a sequel. Well, I'm going to fuck it up. You know, it reminded me just like how with Rob Zombie. Rob Zombie intended the first Halloween to be a one and done. But, you know, the studio was like, wow, it's doing good. And, you know, it's getting popularity. It's getting a lot of people behind it. So, you know what? Why you don't do a sequel, a fourth sequel? So they gave Rob Zombie more money. And you see how that turned out. This movie is not the type of Joker, like being a DC fan. If you're a DC fan and you expect Joker to evolve and become better and stronger in what he's doing, that's not happening here. You're getting a musical. Yes, you get some great performances and stuff with what they got, what they got in their script. But it's nothing that is like evolving and going forward as far as developing the Joker character and, you know, seeing a different vision and a different take. Not him dancing as an extra and Lady Gaga performing all this music and all these songs and all this stuff. And it's like, come on, who wants to see a musical? Now, if you're a big fan of musicals, by all means, go ahead, watch it, spend your money. But if you're a DC fan, it's a waste of time. I wouldn't do it. I don't recommend it. Trash. Complete fucking trash. Why? It was a waste of time. I wasted time out of my life for this shit. Joker 2. Really?